Welcome to My Long Island TV. From Manhasset to Montauk, we have traveled our communities to bring you the following events. I'm your host, Waldo Cabrera. My Long Island TV starts now. Welcome to the Caring Vet. I'm Dr. Michael Selmer, and this is Bella, female English Bulldog. She's here with her mom, Mrs. Cusio. We've had Bella since she's seven weeks old, and um, at the age of 12 weeks, she started to get very sick. Missing hair here, she had baldness here, her whole face. Um, she had lots of redness. Um, she had tear stains and redness in her wrinkles. Originally, Bella had a, a skin parasite called demodectic mange. And we had found that she was very sensitive to different food types. So in the specific dietary formulation for her, we had to eliminate things that we felt that she was having allergies to. We determined what compounds, nutraceuticals, vitamins, and enzymes were missing from her body. We then created a custom blend of those enzymes so we could add it to her diet to help make her metabolic system work better. She's on regular healthy food, no medication anymore, just supplements, home-cooked organic food, organic vegetables, organic plain yogurt, organic meat, flax oil, and we mix it all up, and she loves it. <laughs> Once we did that and supplemented her metabolic pathways with the proper nutrients, nutraceuticals, and glandulars, her body started to work right again. It was the combination of, um, I guess, the commercial dog food doesn't have the nutritional value in it, and it also has a lot of things in it that causes allergies that dogs shouldn't have, like corn and wheat, soy, um, all that was just causing her to continue to get sick, so from, from like seven weeks on, she was eating that food and getting sicker and sicker. Sometimes you get, you know, like you'll get a lot of negative feedback, especially with the bulldog breeds, that you just have to accept things, and you shouldn't accept anything. There's always an answer out there if you love your pet. And the home cooking thing, it's really not that difficult. It actually strengthens the bond between us, I think, and I enjoy doing it for her. You, you really can't just provide a, a home-cooked meal without the proper directions. I advise everyone at home to cook for their dogs, but to do it under strict guidance. Make sure that your dog is tested through blood testing and urine analysis and fecal testing, as well as through a complete history with a licensed veterinarian who can do a nutritional analysis and consultation. That way, your dog's nutritional program that is specified for their exact metabolic needs. Again, I am Dr. Michael Selmer, The Caring Vet.